Welcome to day five of the seven days of calm. Today we're going to talk about one of the challenges of meditation, stopping and taking the time to do it. For many of us, putting a pause on productivity is difficult. We love to feel like we're getting somewhere and accomplishing things. We've become addicted to visible progress. Therefore, sitting and meditating to some might appear to be inactive and unproductive. There's nothing further from the truth. The daily rush against the clock provides the illusion that the more we do and the more we accomplish is what drives our success. This is a misinformed and counterintuitive belief. As we fill up every moment, we leave no space to observe what's going on in our minds and bodies, no opportunity for clarity and insight, no room for rest, recovery, and healing, or for creativity and new ideas to be born. So there's tremendous value in this time you're spending in stillness and non-doing. Start today's practice by finding a comfortable spot where you can settle in with a relaxed yet wakeful posture. Close your eyes, allowing the spine to be tall. Let your shoulders fall naturally and keep your chest open. Begin to relax your breath, observing its flow as you inhale and exhale. With each breath, Settle deeper into your body, relaxing any obvious tension you may be holding. As you continue to breathe naturally, bring your awareness to how your body feels as a whole, sensing if there's any stress or anxiety, tightness or fatigue. Whatever comes up is fine. Just notice how you feel in this moment. Observing your body on your next inhale, take notice of where you feel the breath most clearly. It may be the abdomen as it rises and falls. It may be the chest as it expands and contracts or it may be the base of the nostrils where the air flows above the upper lip. Wherever you notice your breath most clearly, let that become your focus of attention. Breathe in and out, keeping your mind concentrated on just the breath, nothing but the breath. As you sit, your mind will likely wander off to your daily list of things to do. We're tempted to dive into our thoughts as we've come to believe they require immediate attention. But as urgent as they feel, all thoughts, all activities, whatever lists you have, can wait. It's a refreshing change to do something without an agenda, where the only goal is to see what's going on. Give yourself permission to put a brief pause on your mental activity, creating a calm you can take with you through the day. Let yourself settle into stillness, remaining aware of your breath as it flows in 
and out, following each inhale to its end and each exhale to its completion. Notice if your mind is busy or quiet, knowing that thoughts flow and emotions come and go. Accept whatever comes up without judgment. Use this time to observe, quiet, and declutter. Develop comfort sitting in the state of being rather than doing, a state where you can heal, recharge, and train your mind to return to the only moment that matters, this moment, this time, this place. Continue to follow your breath from the start of each exhale to its completion, breathing in and out. For most of us, the act of doing is difficult to stop. We don't think twice about running ourselves to the ground, working overtime, because of our belief that non-stop action will get us further ahead. Of course, what ends up happening is we end up exhausted, sick, or burnt out. There's a reason it takes the bulk of our vacation to finally unwind. If we meditate, and learn to pay attention to when we need to stop on a regular basis, we'll notice unwinding won't take nearly as long. So today, as a way to bring this peaceful state into your daily life, when you notice you're feeling rushed or stressed, overwhelmed or anxious, take a few minutes to stop and bring your attention to the breath. It's something you can do at your desk, on a walk, or anywhere. Remind yourself of the value of non-doing and give yourself permission to take a few minutes to slow down, observe, and recharge. And as the practice finishes, keeping your eyes closed, bring your attention back to the room. Gently wiggle your fingers and toes and notice how your mind and body feel 
after resting in a state of non-doing. Now slowly open your eyes. Congratulations for completing day five of the seven days of calm. Tomorrow we'll explore one of the most important qualities cultivated through the practice of mindfulness, patience. Have a wonderful day and I look forward to seeing you tomorrow.